welcome back to my channel. Um, today, my face. <laughs> um, I wanted to do a monthly favourites video. Um, I've been thinking a lot about other content that I could add to my channel and um, I kind of figured that um, doing some sort of vlog would be kind of cool. Um, but I didn't necessarily just want to do a vlog and just like chat at you because um, my life's not that exciting. <laughs> um, so I kind of figured that a monthly favourites might be kind of fun. Um, we can have a look at some of my favourite um, makeup stuff, some of my favourite nail stuff. Um, music and movies and TV that I'm kind of into at the moment and maybe just some other cool things that I've managed to find each month um, to talk you guys through. Um, so let's get started. Um, so the first thing that I've got for you today is going to be nail related. Um, I thought we'd kind of ease in gently. Um, so the first thing is um, a couple of new creative shop stamping plates. Um, so I've um, been lucky enough to be sent a couple for review um, and they are Creative Shop 104 and 102. Um, I'm going to put some little pictures of these up um, on this video properly um, and there are some swatches um, and some tests of these plates on my Instagram. I'll put the link down below. Um, they're really, really lovely plates. So 104 um, is actually, if you can kind of see that, it's um, full of these really lovely um, lace images really nice um, and um, you can mix and match your own lace so it's got um, little flowers little decorations little adornments and you can kind of layer up the stamping to create a really pretty mani and I've actually done a couple um, of manicures with these so I'll put the pictures up and um, you can see the um, full details in the description box below. Um, 102 I haven't played with quite as much I've only done sort of maybe one or two manis with this um, but again it's it's full of these really cute um, textured images and patterns um, that for me really really just are begging to be um, reverse stamped because I love a reverse stamp. So um, again I'll put some pictures up um, on the video so you can kind of see what they look like. Um, but these are really cute. Um, they are at the moment available from Creative Shop Direct. Um, I don't know if they will be uh, made available in the UK or um, in any other countries at the moment through any resellers, um, but I will look into it and if they are then I'll pop it down in the description box below for you guys. One of the coolest things that I have managed to find, now I'm probably a little bit late to the game with this, um, but the coolest thing that I managed to find um, was actually um, from I Heart Makeup and it is the Unicorn's Heart Highlighter and oh my god it's adorable, it's a little rainbow heart, it's just the most adorable thing I've ever seen in my life. I don't know if you guys can actually see that, um, but it's so cute, it's just adorable and it's a proper cute little rainbow highlighter um, and you can just swipe your finger across it, let me see if I can just do it quick, so you can sort of see um, there that it is just really really super shimmery, it's really pretty um, and the colour that comes out is, is kind of a um, sort of an icy silvery blue when it's all mixed together but it's super super pretty, um, I'm actually wearing it at the moment and I'm absolutely loving it. It's from Superdrug, I got this one in Superdrug, um, I don't think it was very expensive, it was just a couple of pounds but I'll put the link in the description box below so you can see. Um, I'm a massive fan of Makeup Revolution and I Heart Makeup. Um, their stuff is, particularly their eyeshadows and their highlighters, they're really pigmented um, and a little goes a really long way um, and price wise they're like four or five pounds a palette so you can't really go wrong. <laughs> um, so yeah, that will be linked in the description box below as well. Next up on my list of things, so um, you guys have probably seen if you follow me on Instagram, um, I have a bit of an obsession with my glasses. Um, I'm not, I, I actually do need glasses, um, I do actually wear prescription lenses, um, I'm not just doing it for, uh, you know, for the, the Instagram likes, um, I genuinely do need to wear glasses. Um, so I stumbled upon a website, um, which I will link in the description box below, um, direct site, and um, they do these amazing frames. Um, I only owned one pair of glasses before this, um, a pair of black Converse glasses, and they cost me an absolute fortune. Um, and I really wanted to have a couple of new pairs of glasses that would you know, allow me to kind of change up my look. So I found this website, um, and, and these glasses were 15 pounds each, uh, which is just amazing. Um, and they were delivered within four days. Um, the prescription is absolutely amazing. 
and um, they are just perfect and I'm really really happy with them um, and yeah they're, they're just great so I've actually ordered them in like three colours um, so I will post a little video montage here of me in my three different colours of glasses for you. So yeah, you can see these are really cute, they're really cool, um, and they're really, really comfortable actually for like, you know, cheap budget glasses. Um, and I'm I'm absolutely loving them, I think they're really great. So I put a link in the description box below if anybody wears glasses and would like a pair, they're down there. Um, they also do them as sunglasses as well, so if you just want a really cool pair of like Wayfair style sunglasses, you can get those down there below as well. Um, music is a big passion of mine and a big um, part of my life. I do everything to music and currently um, my obsession um, is very firmly within the realms of K-pop. Um, I'm probably a little bit old uh, to be um, such a K-pop obsessive at this point in my life, but honestly, YOLO, whatever. Um, BTS, 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 BTS. Um, love Yourself, Her is absolutely fabulous. I'm really, really digging it. Um, the tracks are absolutely brilliant. Um, I was really, I've, I'm always really blown away by, by all of their albums, to be honest. This latest album, rather, is, it, it's just, it sounds, seems like it's really grown. Um, it's really cool. Um, some of my favorite tracks are probably Pied Piper. I'm, I'm really addicted to um, the really sort of chill sound of it. Um, but conversely, the lyrics are absolutely brilliant. Um, it's a very cocky, um, very self-aware song, and I really, really like it. Um, and, and actually, ironically, the intro, um, the serendipity intro, it's just beautiful. It's so short, but it's beautiful. Um, and lyrically, I, I think it's absolutely brilliant. Um, it really irritates me when people are like, oh, um, you know, because it's in a foreign language, I don't want to listen to it because I can't understand it, so what does it matter? It's like, well, first of all, you can kind of understand the the implication and the emotion behind the tone and the sound of the music and the sound of the singer. And second of all, bitch, that's what Google's for. Like, go Google the lyrics, like read them in English and then you'll understand what the song's about. And then once you know, you know. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm really, really loving um, BTS at the moment particularly. Um, so I will leave a link in the description box below um, to this particular album. Um, if you want to check it out, um, there are some like free sample clips. And I'll also link a couple of YouTube videos of a couple of their songs down there as well so you can just have a little listen and, and let me know what you think um so i think that's really about it for today guys um i don't really want to keep you too long um i know that my interaction drops off around about the 10 minute mark so we'll try and keep this short and sweet um so yeah let me know what you thought about this new format um if you actually want to see any more of my face or if it's like no actually just stick to your nails you're all good um, and yeah, if, if I get sort of a, you know, a, a positive response, then I'll hopefully do another monthly favourites video next month. Um, and maybe in the meantime, I'll think about other opportunities to um, get my hideous face in front of the camera. <laughs> okay guys, um, I hope you did enjoy as I say, and uh, I'll speak to you soon. Bye!